lot of questions after the bodies of three men were found in a central Kentucky home. The gruesome discovery was made late last night by a friend who knew some of the victims. The victims were all found in a home on Pine Ridge Road in rural Clark County. That's near the Powell County line. 27 Sky First flew over the scene today where many friends and family members of the victims were on scene. State police detectives aren't releasing much information, but they say the scene remains an active investigation. Our Dave Spencer is live in Clark County with more in our top story at 5. Good afternoon, Dave. Now, police say they found three friends all shot to death inside this home. And now neighbors and police want to know how and why this could have happened. Around 11 last night, Margaret Stamper found out the hard way about Kentucky State Police's triple homicide investigation. Everybody's screaming Clayton was dead, that there's blood everywhere. Outside, friends and family of one of the victims, Clayton Edge, gathered outside the crime scene with a lot of questions yet to be answered. All I can tell you is we have a triple homicide. Stamper, a neighbor who lives across the street, says she didn't know the victims well, but well enough to know he didn't deserve to die that way. Never did anything bad to anybody. I don't see why anybody would want to hurt him, you know. As for the investigation, police say it's still in the very early stages, basically saying three men in their 20s or 30s were found shot to death in the home, and they're calling it a homicide investigation. We processed the scene. Uh, we've tried to talk to some of the neighbors and tried to develop some leads. Right now, we don't have a whole lot to go on, though. Do you have any suspects? No. Police spent roughly 12 hours here at the scene, wrapping up their evidence collection and interviewing neighbors this morning. Now, just seconds ago, state police released the names of the other two victims, Robert Reese and Dustin Browning. Of course, with this new information, we'll have much more to tell you coming up at 6. But for now, live in Clark County, Dave Spencer, WKYT 27 News First. Well, state police say the two other victims were visiting Edge at the time of those murders.